Hi, my name is Lauren Perret, and I will be reading Quisiara de Clairere by Erica Meitner. The primary purpose of this visit is the check in the box. The yes business of this perpenetic pleasure trip is declared, is vanished, is I almost disappeared once to OO Oklahoma with a check the box, a man I fell in blank with over the business of close proximity, over the roaring yes phone. Another time, it was a guy on a plane to Bangkok. He got off in New Delhi, got off in Bam Bombay, got off in Alaska on the refueling stopover, left me with fruits, plants, food, insects, left me with meat, animals, wildlife products, left me with a hickey as big as Chiang Mai and a case of continental drift, shift me one gear up, clutch to local, available, single, potable, Drink me down and don't worry. I won't hang on like typhoid or dysentery. I own an imaginary boyfriend, extraordinaire, tongue maker, heartbreaker. I am so faithful and he is so invisible. I don't even have to declare him, not even to customs officials, because I have read the crucial information on the reverse side of this form and I have made a truthful declaration. In some countries, it is customary to declare nothing. The Facebook said to use the word tango, to use the word nada. The Spanish I know is from Sesame Street, Salada, exit. Tonight, I was strolling the sawdust floor of the worst bar in town, Proximity. It was called the Real Luck Cafe or Earl's. It was called the Double Down. It was called the Tip of Few. Total value of declared articles, nil. But I came home at dawn, and I would like to declare that I am not a visitor. I am declaring that I came home a resident. The primary purpose of this, I checked the box, a citizen. I swear I had made a truthful declaration. The primary purpose of this visit, I came home to you. And I'll start off by saying... Um, the meaning of the title of this poem, Qui Ciara de, de Clarere, um, means custom declaration. And for those who aren't familiar with the term, because I had to look it up too, it's a form or a statement showing goods being imported on which duty will um, have to be paid. And I like this poem a lot about a girl traveling on a plane meeting boys throughout her long journey and um, many pit stops and um, the poem sounds like it was written um, while she was uh, filling out paperwork I don't know if you caught it while I was reading it but there are some random words in the poem such as check in the box and a blank uh, citizen and primary purpose of this visit was and those were all in parentheses and she answers them and um, she also must have learned a lot from her journey and wanted to go back to the one she loved at the end of the poem it says I came home to you and um, the author meant for this poem to be read fairly quickly I tried my best but um, she wrote it while listening to a California radio station, which was playing mar um, mariachi music after midnight, and that influenced the fast pace of the poem and some rhythm as well. And I'll leave you with my favorite part of the poem is, I own an imaginary boyfriend extraordinaire. And I am so faithful, and he is so invisible. Thanks.